Oh, Matt, did we talk about this? Um, I, did, I still haven't seen this show yet, but you were actually on that show that you talked about. Have we talked about this before? It's been so long. That show with the football football guys. Blue Mountain State. Blue Mountain State, baby. Blue Mountain State, yeah. You were actually on that show? I was in the movie. Wow. Yeah. What did you say in there? What did you do in there? How did that happen? I, I Have we like, talked about this? I don't want to bore anyone if we talk no, about I, this. I, I, get, I get tagged in this all the time. People, like, they'll watch the movie and they're like, wait, is that Matt? Uh, yes, it is me. Um one of the most random experiences, opportunities that I've had. Um, I was at a competition and I don't remember if I was competing or what, but I was with the crew from Kill Cliff and my buddy and I were like quoting lines from the TV show. And the guy from Kill Cliff was like, what are you guys quoting? And we're like, oh, it's this TV show used to be on called Blue Mountain State. And he's like, oh, football one, right? And I'm like, yeah, yeah. He's like, he's like, oh, I actually have the script for it on my desk for the movie. And we're like, what? So Kill Cliff was a sponsor of the movie. And we're like, get the fuck out of here. And he was just like, yeah, you want to be in it? And I was like, yes, please. And so so I flew Random down. I think, shit. It was, I think it was like North Carolina <clears throat> or Georgia, one or the other. Um, like got to meet the whole cast, like – was on set for a day and like they just like threw me in one scene randomly because uh kill cliff was involved in it um it was so wild though like seeing all these people that like i've watched on tv for years and then you see them in person and you're like holy shit like you're way different or there are some characters that like they are the character that's on screen and then there's others that like they're just they're just great actors and putting on like you think their personality is going to be totally different but then they're they're just a regular person you know but yeah that must be so weird yeah so I, yeah i was in i was in a scene of uh yeah blue mountain state Thadland. what did you do did you have a talk did you get to say anything did you get a line yeah i had one line um it was like we were in the huddle and the coach was yelling at us um and the coach did like this whole cheer um that was just like ripping the team apart. And then like after the coach, like threw the pom poms at us, I think my line was like kind of catchy though. And then, and then it cut and went to a different scene. And you were suited up in football gear. No, it was like just practice. So like, I think we had on like cleats, but then like uniform. So like the team practice t-shirt and shorts, which and I, no de helmet? I definitely stole it. Oh, good job. Yeah. They and were no like helmets hey. so they could see you. Yeah. Yeah. No helmets. Um, but yeah, it was like when they sent me back to the changing room, they're like, all right, cool. Like your scene's done. You can head out. And I was like, cool. They're like, yeah, just changing room right there. You just throw your clothes in that bin. And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah totally. And I just put my pants, <laughs> I just put my pants and my hoodie back over, the, over the clothes they gave me. I was like, I'm definitely keeping this shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. When did that come out? I want to see that. I mean, that was a while ago. ago. Yeah. yeah. I think, I think I, I went down. I want to say it was like right after the 2015 games or something. Um, but it was crazy. So like for filming, they rented a house that was like out in the boonies. And it was like kind of like a swamp in the guy's backyard. And so they rented it for like a week to do all the filming. And it's this huge old farmhouse, uh, like three, three stories, huge footprint. And so they went in and they had to completely empty everything. And this place looked haunted. It was terrifying. The dude moved out for a week or something. Or I, I no, I think he was sleeping in the shed next to the house. And they're going through and asking him like, hey, wh what do you want us to do with this and this? Like from stuff up on the second, third floor and then in the attic. And he's like, I don't even know what that is. He's like, I haven't been, I haven't been to the second or third floor in like 15 years. Oh, and they're geez. like, what? Like, you live here, right? And he's like, yeah, I live here full time. But like, why would I go upstairs? And so it was just like 30 years worth of dust and cobwebs and all that stuff. But then seeing what the house was like in person, like I'm, we stepped into the house, saw it. And I was like, this place is creepy as shit. I'm getting out of here. And then seeing it in the movie. And it looks like this like super modern farmhouse type thing. It was crazy. Movie magic, baby. Movie magic. Never going to your second floor. Yeah, it was wild. 
like me never going to my second gear. 